Well, here we are, day four, John chapter 19. Yeah. And uh, I just um, I just made the comment that I don't think cha- day four says a whole lot about who Jesus is. Ashrita had some sweet <laughs> comments on how she felt like, yeah, it does show us something about who Jesus is. So, I, Ashrita, share yeah, with us. I think in an indirect way, right? Mm-hmm. Because Jesus, at this point, is dead Mm -hmm. we know that's not the whole picture but from a human perspective the narrative says it's done and yet he has become precious to these two disciples Joseph and Nicodemus and we saw Nicodemus in chapter Mm 3 of Joseph we're told here he was disciple but secretly for fear of the Jews Um, and yet we see almost the immediate impact that Mm -hmm. his life had had on these two disciples Mm -hmm. and that they risk everything to lay him to rest Mm -hmm. like this was the point where his own disciples had run away Mm -hmm. exactly it was easy it would have been so easy for joseph and nicodemus to kind of step away and say well i guess he's not the person we thought he was Mm -hmm. and we're done with him Mm -hmm. and yet instead they show their devotion to jesus Mm -hmm. by this act of faith Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. of taking care of his body after his Mm -hmm. death Mm -hmm. Um, and that to me reminds me almost of Mary's act of devotion Mm -hmm. it was it was costly love Mm -hmm. in their own way for these two men Um, Mm -hmm. and we had talked about this you know just the two of us earlier with this whole chapter it's so easy for it to become an intellectual story that we read and yet we see these two men's lives and hearts had been impacted so personally and I think that's the push of this chapter, is that it wouldn't just be information we collect about who Jesus is, but that it would touch us. It's really a beautiful way to sum up this chapter of, of really, it's their transformation from believing in Christ, having faith in Him. So, mm-hmm. I love your insight. Mm-hmm. That was beautiful. 